Well, hello all. It is I, the Bearded Beerman, back with another brew. Was helping my dad work on a car, and we needed some refreshments. So, went to the local store and picked up some beer from Kona Brewing. This is an Island IPA. The subtle bitterness of hops is balanced with a passion fruit, orange, and guava. Easy does it. Mm. This comes in at... Where'd it go? Where'd it go? 4.5% ABV. Wow. This is almost sessionable. This is the Han Hanale Island IPA. Ah, and at time of filming, this is... So at the time of filming, this is six months old. Uh, yeah, well, fortunately, I bought it at a quick stop, not a good beer place. But that's all right. We'll see how it is. Well, there's fruit smells, so that's good. Very clear, very carbonated. Lots of carbonation. Oh, can you see those bubbles? Oh yeah. Uh, a finger of head, very white, frothy. And I am drinking this beer out of my very own The Bearded Beerman Pint Glass. Mrs. Beerman got that for me for Christmas. Wonderful person, I tell you. Mm. Well, it may be old, but it smells good. Definitely picking up that guava. Holy cow. What other things? Passion fruit, guava, and orange. Getting the guava, getting the orange on the nose. Might be picking up that passion fruit, but maybe it's just what I think I should be smelling. Well, cheers to y'all. Getting a slight bittering on the finish. Getting a kind of that uh, lingering aroma of fruit. Well, you know what? For 4.5%, it's not bad. It's light. And when we bought this, it was 102 degrees outside, working in the sun, on a car. And, um, hey, you needed something refreshing. And it did the job. So, can't argue with that. Mm. You know what? It's not bad. You get a nice orange throughout it. Uh, I'm now kind of, kind of excited to try to find it more fresh. Um, see what other flavors maybe have been diminished over time. That's pretty clean for a six month old beer. Not bad. I won't sneeze at it. And I think I got it for about a dollar a beer. So, still better than other stuff on the market for a dollar a beer. Hmm. Well, I think that's all I'm going to say about that. So, thanks for watching. If you've had some, uh, ancient beers that have turned out to be okay leave some comments below if you like this stuff please hit that like the subscribe tell your friends oh, follow us on the uh, all the great links the instagram facebook twitter youtube all that good stuff but thanks for watching and remember every beer 
is like a good book. You've got to crack it open to find out what's inside. Cheers, y'all.